Okay. <laughs> if, that's, if that's how you want to do it. No. Like, so is there a gate to Tokyo it's right now? Gate to Hong that's Kong. right out there. But that's the one that's in the war zone. Like all the tanks and shit. And it's definitely Finland. a war zone right now. It's not. Oh, yeah. Dr. Coburn. Well, it's yeah. been a little while. Uh, so it might be quiet now. Who knows? We might go back. It might be fucking irradiated. Well, it's not been that long. Maybe a couple weeks. Freddie, the only way to find out is to go there for fuck's sake. Okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'll take I'll take them both to the gate, and I'm gonna put my life mask on. And, right. Uh, By taking them to the gate, are you saying that you're gonna drive number fifteen to the bus? Uh, no, no. I'll take I'll take a bus. Right. You guys. <laughs> Okay, so what kind of gear is on you that you're wanting to take on to a uh, gray dog bus? That 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 and my normal clothes. I'm right, in adventuring put... gear with a chain mail. I got a Buck Rogers gun. I got a putter, and I got a weird metal cylinder hanging from my belt. Uh, I have a whip hanging from my belt as well, and a fedora. All right, never mind. We're taking the car. Chain mail, my trumpet case, my camping gear. So you're in number fifteen, getting ready to pay out another grand. If I class, yeah. You go. Why don't we just take a great hound? No. <laughs> the slide there. You're not sure where he got the Indiana Jones hat or why the fedora. You don't know why he's wearing it and a bullwhip. It disturbs you. Because justice it's fucking gave it to me. You notice your life is falling to pieces. Pedal to the metal, Indy. I'm going, I'm going. No time for love, Dr. Jones. <laughs> uh yeah, it's, uh, I'll take them there. All right. Uh do you remember where where the gate is? It's close to the bus station. But you never described the area to me. I know there was a cash for gold nearby and there was a bus station nearby. Ooh. And it was in like a cave this area. All right. He takes you over there. And it looks like a perfectly ordinary gate. Mm. Swirling, swirling, swirling. Are we taking the car into it or are we walking through? If it's a bit small for the car. Yeah, it's too small. Oh, okay. I get out. I walk through. Okay. I put my mask on and I walk through. Boom. Put my mask on. Right. All right. You've got your mask on and whatnot. You guys emerge into a, a, a kind of messed up looking temple. There's uh, old blood splatters on the walls. Uh, there's a bunch of uh, dead, rotting corpses and such of uh, monks laying there in uh, saffron robes. It looks like uh, Buddha has been machine gunned. Um, you can hear vultures and stuff uh and uh it sounds like dogs fighting over meat oh this area is progressing quickly <laughs> i go my axe out <laughs> he pulls sure out his in so. place ah, yep 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 all right all right so where to um to china oh, beijing okay not Beijing. The boards. Oh. The convents in, in Beijing. Was it in Beijing? Yeah, okay, yeah, Beijing. That's right. The Forbidden City in Beijing. That's the place, the Forbidden City. All right, we start uh, heading that way on foot. No uh, problem. You're out of the building real quick. Look for gun nests. Look for uh, giant Terminator robots floating in the sky. Yes, yes, and yes. Damn Skynet already? <laughs> <laughs> you see various uh, Chinese troops that are currently uh, taking dead bodies and whatnot and putting them into trucks. Mm. I can steal a unit ball, that will help. Mm. Give me an amazing luck roll, Freddy, as you say that. The 
with this one, huh? That was pretty good. Do you guys see three Chinese soldiers approximately your size wandering by, looking around? They've got rifles, and they're like looking for survivors or something. Wait, I think there's a survivor over here. Come here. What language is this in? Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. I fumbled my Mandarin, so... <laughs> It shows the subtitles. Come kill me. I, uh, I spit upon the premiere. I <laughs> stepped to the inside of the doorway with my axe raised above my head, waiting. I got right. a pistol. He pulls out a pistol. Everybody looks at him. Just behind my, right behind my back. Right. Yeah, I no. wait for them to notice me so I can run into the temple more. And they they hurry they hurry toward you. They are I, saying things in a different language. I pull them. All right, they come rushing in. Why are you guys going to standard combat? Uh, is that kind of news, by the way? Uh, yes. All right, let me try and understand what the fuck is just said. So, okay. Excellent. Cool. All right, standard combat. Shaking your fist at them is approved. Heroes are first. They all have uh, rifles with bayonets on them. The three of them go, finally, we found survivors. Maybe their blood type will be the type we need to save the rest of the world. <laughs> Heroes are first, villains are second. Uh, so they come rushing into the uh, temple. And uh, Coburn, what do you do? That guy loses his head. Ching. And Chris, what do you do? I I, I want to lure them in, so I'll wait for them to like. Is it Got like it. a surprise round? So I'm just bringing them in. Got it. And Freddie, what do you want to do? Mm. Uh, oh <laughs> shit. And roll some damage. Uh, what's the crit do? Double. Double. Oh, right. So uh, roll, roll the dice twice. Right, right. Got it. Got it. Got it. Good things is the answer. Uh, yeah. Um, holy mother of hell! His head <laughs> pops off. Blood fountains around. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna. Uh, how far are they from us? Uh, they are right there. You are inside the door, and they are literally, you can reach out and touch them. Or uh, chop uh, off their head with an axe. I'm not going to, I don't want to make noise, though, so I'm going to, I'm going to try and grapple the one closest to. Uh, you drop dump. your pistol on the floor yeah. and attempt to grab the guy with the bayonet and rifle. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I just, I just pictured Freddy on a wall. Ah, it hurts so bad. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Right. You've got him. I don't know what you're going to do with him, but you've definitely got him. I, I just, I'm trying to hold him still. For the other two. Okay. No problem. Uh, the other one remaining guy goes, ah. And we go to, uh, that, that was your surprise round. We go to next round. Heroes are first and get a free reroll, letting out a noisy battle cry is approved. Nice. Uh, Freddy, you're first. What do you do? Can you use it for more time, motherfucker? That's my battle cry. That's not a battle cry. That's a list of demands. <laughs> <laughs> and Doc, what do you do? Right. Yeah. Doc? I'm looking for my quick draw. Okay. And Coburn? Uh, uh, oh, oh, oh free re-roll. Free re-roll. I'll just send, I'll just, uh, Freddy's I'll holding just, on to this one. Yeah. Oh, oh dear. Oh, oh my Yay. God. <laughs> no problem. Fumble card for Doc. I'm going to just, as I'm holding on to him, I'll just maneuver behind him. That's Eight gonna be to the uh, fucking guy trying to skewer Freddy. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm, what I want to do for my action is just hold on to him and maneuver behind him. All right. All right you're, 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 give me a maneuver roll. Yeah, I could hold him in, but stay behind him. Kind of thing. Uh, both Freddy and uh, Coburn, give me a um, uh, luck roll. I want to know who gets the worst. I got the worst. Credit. Cool. One. Yeah, yeah. Yours is better. And right. Uh, 
Chris, do you have a strength bonus? Yeah. Roll D eight for me. Got it. To Freddie, take one stun point as he brings his uh, thing down <laughs> upon your head. <laughs> ah, Ow. Ah. I'm not the one. Hit the other one. <laughs> it wouldn't be so bad if he just didn't keep doing it. And right. Uh, let's see. The the uh, Coburn did eight points of damage. Mm -hmm. The guy lets out a high pitched scream. Ah! He says. Oh, I, I like I, I I that's my new target. Like I, I like I like go. I'm like I'm gonna punch him, and then I'm like, mm -hmm. got it. And now we go for next round. Uh, his round is uh oh wait he's gonna try to break free of Freddy. Uh, I did it my friend. He rides around sensuously in your grasp, dropping his <laughs> rifle, and. Heroes are first. Anything you have to roll for if you succeed is approved. Coburn. So, uh, all right. Which is the one that's green? The one I'm holding on to? The one onto. that you're holding on to. He and I, for my action, put my hand up his mouth to shut him up. That's uh, you can, but Coburn's probably chopping off his head. So That's a dangerous place to put your hands, Freddy. It really okay. is. You start to put up your hand, and you see an oh, axe blade yeah. coming toward it, and you're like, ah! <laughs> Oh, sweet. Crit the martial arts. Does that do anything? No. Double, double. double damage. If you crit the martial arts? Yeah. Hmm. Or the or axe. Crit. Double damage. Yeah. If you crit both, it's triple damage. Right. Here, right. Give me a dodge at half not to have your arm fly off along with the guy's head. Twelve. It goes through 20, the head. Twenty-seven. Through, it goes through everything. It cuts through schools. You're like, nope, <laughs> and it shows your fingernails all getting trimmed. <laughs> These little pieces go. <laughs> Chris, what would you like to do? So they're are they all dead? Uh, yeah. Ha <laughs> ha! I told you not to do that. <laughs> it, it, with all the other noise and stuff and the tanks and shit driving around, apparently nobody has uh, heard it. The only problem is that uh, rather than like clubbing them into submission or whatever, Coburn literally opened up up like pop bottles. Uh, everybody, give me a uh, luck roll at half to see if your uniform is too blood stained to use. What are you talking about? Too blood stained to use? What a call! Oh my god! <laughs> Look your your <laughs> uniforms have no blood. Coburn's looks like somebody uh, uh, chopped off the person's head who was wearing it. That's other your guys' uniforms are spotless. <laughs> That's Coburn easy. Smooth blood on his face. That's fine. No, what we're gonna do now. Now we just need to find like a medic badge and then like put it on your thing, so it looks like you know, being a medic that you oh, might be bloodier can because I, you've been carrying. Can I paint? Can I paint like a medic badge on his arm or something? Uh, do you know what a Chinese med? Give me a Chinese uniform lore roll to know what a Chinese medical badge looks like. Uh, okay. If I met this, that's what. You're gonna fucking paint it on me just so you're like smeared. I, made, with I know what it looks like. Holy fuck, you made it. <laughs> what? <laughs> How the fuck does that work? All right, well, uh, take a check in uh, Insignia of the Chinese Army. <laughs> Great. Chinese yeah. Army Heraldry? Yes, that'd be fine. Um, cool. <laughs> Logan just throws up his hands. Right, you've got a medical badge. Now give me a painting roll, see if you can actually paint it. Well, why don't we just like look for a dead medic, and then you just take the... It appears that uh, there's no dead medics in this temple with you. But no, but there might be paint. out there somewhere. Damn it. He paints something fucked up on your arm. That's fine. I just stand behind the two of them. No problem. You guys uh, head out. Your biggest hold back, hold up now is that I uh, oh, none of the you rifle, are, by the way. what? We take the rifle, obviously. All right. Yes. Now you guys all have rifles with bayonets on them. Uh, Coburn's carrying a trumpet case and an axe, and <laughs> he refuses to give up his axe. He's just carrying an axe with a trumpet case strapped to his back. Looting. Wordless looting. Now. Yeah, I put the rifle in the trumpet case. <laughs> 
Okay, you take off the bayonet and manage to... I break it down. Okay, sure, give me a gunsmithing roll, do properly break down your rifle. Yep. Oh, it's broken, all right. <laughs> <laughs> I got a rifle for you when you need it ready. All right. Uh, all right, you guys are going through... That, that is, that's not supposed to look like that. I fucking... I Get that out of here. I just fucking toss it. Shit. All right. Whoops. Everybody give me a stealth roll at full. This is with the uniforms. The biggest problem is, A, you don't look Chinese at all. B, you don't speak Chinese. So the uniforms are kind of like a can camouflage on you to allow I you to... I speak Mandarin. I speak Cantonese. Wow. All right. Other than being filthy foreigners, you're fine. Coburn blows the whole thing. <laughs> Probably the battle axe, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We'll yell and point at you guys, and uh, we'll get pursuit and whatnot. And Colburn thinks it's the funniest thing ever. <laughs> I hope they do that thing where they run around the corner. I'm behind. That's my favorite thing ever. Are you sticking with that roll, Colburn? Because otherwise, I'm just going to move you on to the next scene. Or does somebody have a reroll for it? Uh, as well? Yeah, has anybody had a reroll? Let me check my cards here. Uh, I have nothing. I'm sorry. Uh, Running may not save you. They do have the power of radio and high tech shit. No, I do not have a. I don't have a for real. Uh, God damn it! All right, hold on. How much pause? Everybody else is good. How much pause am I at? I'm at sixteen. I'll spend one. Eh. Hooray! Yeah, you you more than I do. So. Uh, all right, so I spent one. Now I need to get they back to my don't want to spend any pause either. I'm pretty low. And I re-roll this. <laughs> uh -oh. What? <laughs> I have 20, okay? Oh, boo. -hoo. There we go. Right. Yeah, yeah. No problem. You guys uh, get out of Hong Kong itself. Now, the problem is that uh, in order to go to the mainland, according to Freddy, you have to cross the border checkpoint thing, which... It looks like it's really grown, and they put a lot of extra guards. They got guys with dogs, you know, wandering around and stuff on it. Because apparently they don't like people going from Hong Kong to mainland China or vice versa. You're not really sure what's up with that, but it looks like the checkpoint's gotten a lot stronger. Now, there are a couple of options if you wanted to try it. You're going to need somebody with disguise skill to disguise at least one of you to look more Chinese. And if any of you are good at driving like a half track, then they wouldn't be able to see you. Or you can drive a Jeep and everybody get disguised as Chinese. Is there a, uh, is there a half track around somewhere? There totally is, right over there. Yeah. It's I, unattended. I have operate heavy machinery, and as backup, I also have uh, drive Class A trucks. I would, I would um, go with a uh, uh, Class A truck, and you could support yourself with operate heavy machinery if you wanted to, but you'd still need one person to be able to talk to the border guards or be seen or whatever. Is there, have we seen any dead uh, officers? Uh, give me a luck roll to quarter. They were really quick to clean up their own, but there's plenty of dead civilians that they're now working on cleaning up. No, but you did find a dead NCO. Hold on. <clears throat> Yeah, it's better than nothing. Uh, are these uniforms the Hong Kong military or Chinese military? People's Republic, or according to your weird skill that you just picked up, you think that they're uh, the <laughs> Chinese mainland uh, army Chinese uniforms. mainland, okay. Uh, I'll, take, I'll take that. It, it's better than nothing. Great. No problem. You've got a dead NCO. Uh, are you going to weekend at Bernie's the dead NCO? No, I was going to wear his uniform. Oh well, no! That it's the face that I'm I'm concerned about here. In order to have somebody who can speak uh, uh, Mandarin and looks Chinese, because you're definitely wearing the uniforms. Uh, you upgrade to an NCO uniform, no problem there. Well, I'm I'm I'll just be nice and assume the uniform can fit the giant white guy, um, the giant muscular well, white guy. How would the eyes even work? Like, how would change your eyes? Uh, actually, there's a whole bunch of ways of doing that. But what if it just like tie a really thin elastic band around your eyes and just pull them back, let you look Asian? 
Allocation. So let's go. Okay. Give me a what? really good luck roll there, Chris. At least by half to just da 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 da. No, you saw what I did, right? Oh no, I missed it. Small shape shifting. Motherfucker. He is Asian now. As long as he can pull off uh, speaking in Mandarin, he's golden. You, okay. uh, wait, no. Okay, for small shape shifting, did you re read the thing? Oh uh, well, because. Okay, you, so get one, I, you get one thing. So if that is your one thing ever, and then if you get in there, credit, you can Oh, is that how thing. it works now? Yeah. And then if you get crit in it, you could say, I want to become Asian more than once a day, or I want to get gills, or... Look whatever. at the face. Pardon? Really? I, I, I clearly have already chosen gills at this point. Okay. All right. Um, um, okay. Oh, because I've used gills multiple times. Yes, that's a good point. Uh, go ahead and give me a luck roll at half, then, to just reach down and pick up something that'll make everything good. <clears throat> uh, you find some shades that will make your fast talk much more difficult because they're not regulation and stuff, but... Okay. Cool. Cool. Uh, right now, it's all down to Colburn. Colburn, you can uh, operate your truck skill. Or you can support with operate heavy machinery. There is a fucking machine gun on this bitch too. If anybody wants to play with that, uh, and it's fully loaded and ready to go. But the Chinese soldiers didn't think that anybody would steal because they've killed most everybody or driven them. Are there, Logan? Are there any packs of cigarettes in here? Yes. Thank you. All right. Um, and a lighter. Hooray. I, uh, let's see. Okay, so operate heavy machinery for my backup assist. Success. What is that, plus five? Yep. And if anybody else has any skills to... Let's say crit. Uh, right. No more <laughs> driving rolls needed for you for this. You're oh. fine. And Chris, what do you want to do as the NCO? I just order... Like, I want to be, like, ordering him to, like, go through... And if are I like, you, like, like I'm, I'm you, like arguing with these guys, like I'm, like I'm saying, like go go. And then when they come up to the thing, I'm like, why are you stopping me? We need to right. get. Are you wanting to be like sitting at the like uh, how tank commanders always were sitting out of turret type thing on top? So yeah, I'll have like, and if they have one of those ear things, I'll have the oh, ear yeah. thing in with one off, so I can like point. You are totally in communication with Colburn, and if Freddie wants to put on his. Yeah. Uh, your communication with them. No problem. Give me a acting role and a uh, Mandarin role. The Mandarin role is super important. The acting, uh, it's not. If you blow that, it's no big deal. But the uh, oh, the talent just oozes out of you. Uh, right, people wave you guys through. Mm. He is driving this uh, fucking multiple wheels uh, and stuff. It's It's got, like, lots of wheels on it, tires and shit on both sides. He's driving it like a fucking boss. Um, you guys pretty much just uh, end up cruising through. Uh, one, of the, one of the guys says, where are you going, Sergeant? We're going to the port. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know how to respond. You guys head on. No problem. You can eventually get clear of the exclusion zone. So if you want to uh, try pushing it with the uniforms, you can do that, or you can switch to other shit. But um, yeah, you are you get past the um, big border controls. They're not really thinking anybody's going to steal a fucking heavy military vehicle and drive it through. Got a big red star on the side and shit. Okay. You guys want to go civilian or stay military? I think we should stay where we're at. Like we have the, we have the look. We can. I think we can pull it off. the The only problem is once you get out of this area, because there's a lot of like these kind of vehicles. But once you get beyond them, then it becomes like more and more and more civilian as you go. You know now, what civilians don't do in fucking China? Mess with the cop. They don't fucking mess with the giant fucking military vehicles. Mm. Also, another thing I was thinking, like maybe we could stop like near the port because I'm sure that's where off-duty 
uh, soldiers would be, and maybe they have papers, like uh, off-duty papers or like uh, weekend pass papers. Uh, the the only the only problem is again you're not Chinese and neither of these two maniacs would hold up as Chinese at all. But is everybody just Chinese? I mean, it is no, no. Uh, but such a majority that you would definitely be remembered. Mm. Oh, I already have a. I already have something good for that. Okay, sure. Give me spy lore rolls if you would like. And Freddie, if you'd like to try your. Uh, um, uh, Chinese heraldry thing. Again. Spy lore. <laughs> sure. Um, spy lore. Yeah, spy lore for everyone. Colburn might make it. He just goes. <sighs> nope. Uh, I'm trying to tell what it is. Nope. Okay. Um, and that's it. Cool. Uh, everybody give me a Chinese army lore roll. According to Colburn, battle axes are in. All soldiers carry battle axes. I thought I had that written down here somewhere. What, Chinese army lore? I'd be rather impressed if you did. <laughs> uh, damn it. Oh, well. All uh, up to you, Colburn, to suddenly whip this out. There. Wow. Well, uh, it's a number now. Cool. I right. I you're not really sure who to talk to on the papers and stuff like that. And plus Doc's Mandarin is not great, I don't think. You're not fluent, are you? Seventy four. Oh my god. All right. He goes and starts chatting with people. Doc, give me a fast talk roll. You don't need to roll Mandarin anymore. Got it. All right. Yeah, you find some people that are on leave and stuff like that. Um, I think I know what's coming up, so go ahead and give me a press digitation roll if you want their <laughs> shit. This is the one to make. Yeah, right, 30. at half. Okay, great. Um, and since you made it half, I, after talking to several different people, you get different papers and shit. Uh, the pictures don't really match these guys, but, you know, hopefully people won't look too quick. And you did get some Jeep uh, keys from a uh, Chinese military Jeep. So now you've got papers, Jeep. You don't look like the guys in the papers, but, you know, you did the best you could on short notice. Uh, hey, Doc, do a real simple disguise on me. Just bandage the left side of my face. I'll oh, bandage yeah, the help. left side of his face, but I'm not going to disguise him. I'm just going to... Yeah, give me a first aid roll to make an expert doctoral bandage. No. Right. I, put, I give him a turban. <laughs> <laughs> the one roll I didn't think you'd fucking fail. I, I, uh, I'd like to take that off and do uh, my own. Uh, uh, are you sure you can do it for you? You want me to do it for you? I'll help you. Sure, Freddie. <laughs> I help nice. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, wait, why am I rolling that? What the fuck are we doing? Roll that roll. What is going on? Uh, first aid. Um, minus 10, but I'm lazy to put in. Oh, my God. Uh, that fail with the minus 10 spell. Right. You've got a different turban on. I'd be. I'm fucking oh, no. it all off. What are you guys? Get the fuck away from me. Oh, wait, why do you. Oh, wait, it's a plus five. Yeah, sorry. I was looking at. Yeah. Did you make uh, it? No, I did make it. Sorry. Okay. Oh, all right. I saw the fumble and I was like, wait. Oh, wait. Yeah. Come on. I don't know about you, Freddie, but people won't question me anymore. Yes. I got the Asian burned the fuck off of me in the war. God damn. I don't know if it works like that, but okay. I love to that. Okay. Well, they look at me, my guy's whole fucking just mangled, burned the fuck up. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. They, you had to bandage your good side, not your bad side. I guess. Yeah, yeah. So fucked up. I had the Asian burned off. Uh, I just wear a pair of sunglasses. Do I didn't have a pair of sunglasses? I'm wearing them. Oh. You have another pair? No. Are there a pair in the Jeep, maybe? A bad, bad Give me pair? a luck roll, Freddy. You're a really lucky guy. You make it a half. Nice regulation sunglasses. Right, quarter. quarter, there's two regulation pair of sunglasses. No, I, I put on one pair. All right. I'll take I have the other one. Cool. Yeah. Yep. 
There we go. Now the eyes are covered. Right. Uh, you make Freddie drive the Jeep? Yeah. Cool. Uh, you got on the road again. Uh, now you run into a new problem, two new problems. First off, according to Freddie, it's how many days to get to Beijing by driving? Several. Surely. Okay, Freddie's faulty memory is the first problem that you have. I've got. never been to Beijing. Why not me? Of course. The second problem is he doesn't know where it is that you're going. The third problem is that um, that everybody doesn't. Uh, yeah. Yeah, actually, there's a map in here, so somebody could try to. Yeah, I found the glove box and just fucking grab the map out of the glove box. Sure, give me a navigation roll, and I'll tell you how many days it is to Beijing. I don't know why you're asking me. Yep. No problem. Excellent. Let me. Was it three days? I think it's four, but I'll double check. Beijing. It says, sorry, we can't figure out how to get there. What? Um, right. Well, I meant, let me put in the other town name here. Because it's like, sorry, you can't get to there from here. Because, you know, Guangzhou. There you go. How many days is that? Okay. Uh, actually, you can... If you if you are all willing to make a driving roll, you can get there much much faster. It looks like it it be basically a full flat out day of driving. The problem is you have no money or anything like that. I have Hong Kong dollars. Oh, do you? Hong Kong yeah. dollars, you say? I'm sure that in mainland China they would love to see their yeah, good Japanese yeah. money. Um, yeah. I I can uh, fucking drive through if need be. Oh, I can, well, as a drive, as a drive, Jeep or drive car? Car. Car. Yeah, I, I can drive as well. Yeah, so you've got at least two drivers that can switch back and forth, although, uh, well, you guys are full of willpower. I know Freddie is able to stay away. Uh, yeah. But uh, the money for the fuel is the only thing. Um, we'll just siphon that shit. So, crime spree through across mainland China? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Doc doesn't even look up, just nodding at like, yeah. All right, no problem. Uh, let's see. Um, siphoning the vehicles. Uh, give me pick lock and a stealth for the first of two. Pick and lock. Uh, yeah, they, the, uh, uh, it's a big vehicle, big gas canister. Oh, yeah, he unlocks it. You siphon the gas. What else do you and want? And for from one of you. I don't care who does the stealth roll. Oh, I thought you said jury rig. Sorry. Oh yeah, you you now have a siphoning hose. All right, and <laughs> no problem. You guys do your little crime spree across mainland China. Uh, Freddie, since the bulk of the driving is going to fall on you, give me a willpower and a driving roll. This is the, I will stay awake and fucking drive like an automaton. Uh, three for the willpower. Yeah. And driving. <laughs> Joseph going off the bridge. Oh, right. <laughs> you guys are driving off of a bridge. The Jeep explodes halfway down. You're I guess uh, I shouldn't be smoking while we're in the middle of siphoning either, huh? <laughs> Your on fire bodies then uh, hit a. Uh, uh, so no, 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 no. start emptying the fucking extra gas can on myself. <laughs> I don't have a vivo or no. <laughs> no, he would have used it before. So. <clears throat> uh, you know the Jeep blew up halfway down. Oh, there we go. So the entire Jeep uh, blew up then, or what's up? No, no, I had spent a hero point. Yay, oh. another hero point siphoned away from Freddy like you're siphoning the gas from good, hardworking, decent Chinese people. So, right. You guys eventually come cruising into Beijing. Doc, you and Colburn are pretty good to go. Freddy looks like he has been rode hard and put away wet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's That's adorable course. when he looks like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you want to put a bag on his head so you don't have to see him like that? <laughs> 
Uh, and there's a lot of different TV stations talking about warning people that foreign insurgents are instigating riots and stuff, so that they should be very careful of foreigners. Oh, look at Freddie. I got one. <laughs> and that's how Freddie got turned into the Chinese uh, army. <laughs> I'm here for my reward. <laughs> Freddie, once again, gets fingered. <laughs> oh. At least once a session. At least once a session. <laughs> so, uh, do you want to? Well, you have no money to get anywhere to stay, and sleeping in an army jeep is not really comfortable at all. So, you guys sleep in the army jeep. That's the next day. I mean, I can set up a fucking campsite right next to the fucking jeep. Oh, yeah, there you go. Unfortunately for Freddy, he has weird dreams and stuff because even though he's doing everything he can, it's apparently not enough for some people out there who just want it now, 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 now. And then plus, I've got this whole section called Freddy's Dreams. Um, right. There's a handprint on a computer scanner in front of you. You see your hand extending toward it, Freddy. It's extending you want to touch it, Freddy? Touch it? No. No. You draw back your hand. I tried to wake up. You go, eh, and you hear, please proceed to the HR department. Listen here, Justice. I just want to get a good night's rest. I'm doing everything I can. Just let me get some sleep, all right? You see tentacles shoot out of the uh, hand scanner. Oh, I, I touched the fucking hand scanner. <laughs> right. And you press the hand scanner, and a blue line shows up on the floor. You follow it over to uh, a some faceless person in HR. They sit you down. And a second. Two. Two. They unveil this machine here. The HR person says, reaction time is a factor in this, so please pay attention. Now answer as quickly as you can. <laughs> you wake up uh, finding finding uh, Doc is looking at you. How you doing? I will love and come back to this. Why aren't you saving the turtle? <laughs> Go away, I'm sleeping. <laughs> the turtle is on its back. Why? He's, he needs water. Why aren't you saving the turtle? I just ignore him. It's, it's daytime. Apparently, that was your sleep. <laughs> oh, my head hurts. Also, I blow the dream as well. Damn it, Justice. Just look. Why are you going to be so unreasonable? Who's he talking to now? Hell, look around. Apparently, uh, Doc. Justice is invading my dreams. You gotta work on fucking... Either that or someone else doing it, but... You gotta work on getting the defenses of your mind up a little bit more, Freddy. Yes, because I can do that when I'm asleep. Yeah! Alright, hey. okay, tell, how? Please, sensei. How do I steal my mind? Before you go to bed, think about walls. Think about security. Um, okay. I'll teach you uh, pattern defense, and that'll work. <laughs> so what you do is you Did steal it? your mind. You think of the pattern. And while you're thinking of the pattern, you steal yourself by knowing that its formula is what keeps you safe. Do you already have pattern defense there, Freddy? No, no. I, I didn't make it. Yeah, I don't, I don't think you can teach that anyway. It's not <laughs> one of the teachable ones, but uh -oh. it's good of you to try. So, uh, right, where to? I have, I have Trump defense, but. Hooray. Uh, yeah, I'm not. Uh, so. Um, Look, you guys are the ones who want to come to Beijing. You're in Beijing. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Did you find what the sister's name is or 
what she looks like. Uh, yeah, we had it written down. Uh, uh, okay. Uno momento, por favor. Wait, you're actually going to be able to tell me? Co or me impressed. Her actual name? No. Um, but the last name should be Young, and she should be the brother of Zin Hai. And when she was put into the co 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 covenant, she was 18 years old. Actually, Doc, you know that uh, uh, Coburn's a little incorrect on this. Her last name is Zin because in Chinese culture, they put the last name first, family is first. Hmm. But um, yes, that should be enough. Um, now, nobody's climatized for some reason that is beyond me toward Beijing, but now might be the time to begin working on it. Everybody give me a streetwise or research role at half to know something about Beijing that is relevant. Have it both or just one? No. Pick your, your pick. Okay. No. So you guys are in a stolen army, Jeep stolen army uniforms, uh, clutching a battle axe, cruising around the uh, streets of Beijing. Hmm. Where to? Uh, well, to the Forbidden City, I suppose. You guys go to the Forbidden City and you find out it's just a tourist thing. Lots of very old wooden structures carefully preserved. What you're looking for is not here. That's why Freddy left, right? He's like, yes. I'm out. You're coming in soft again, Chris. Sorry, I'll get. I'll try to get hard for you. Thank you. When suddenly Freddy says... Good. All right. So, as I was saying, uh, you reach the Forbidden City. It appears to just be a uh, wooden tourist uh, thing that you can wander around in. Uh, good news, since you're in Army uniforms and they figure you must be in the Army, admission is free. They tell, they tell Doc Fulton things. He bows to them. They bow back. <coughs> and you guys go in, wander around, and absolutely don't find what you're looking for here. You guys are smelling a little bit funky as you've been sitting literally in these same uniforms that you've taken off of dead soldiers for quite some time. I uh, say in uh, crazy Cantonese to Chris, Everybody looks at him for a moment. <laughs> people, people come up. <laughs> right. Uh, some lady looks shocked and comes up and begins <laughs> reprimanding him in Cantonese. I fucking nod, bow, hold my hands, and back away from her. Somebody else comes up and uh, is saying something to Colburn. They keep taking him by we his arm. Two yen. <laughs> Do you guys, do you guys, uh, Coburn, uh, old Chinese lady's trying to lead you away. Oh, all right, I go. Oh, she'd love you a long time. She's saying something in uh, Mandarin to you. I keep fucking nodding and bowing and just fucking go with her. All right, no problem. She takes him off. Where do we head to once we leave that place? Uh, she's taking she's taking you into like one of the uh, uh, are you two wanting to kind of follow along or uh, okay. that's what she said Chris Chris sneezes yes and uh, right uh, she's taking you into like one of the little uh, spots that people who work here hang out in and stuff and she's breaking out iodine and stuff like that Hmm. Uh, wanted to get you fucking radiated. <laughs> she begins dabbing your wounds and stuff, hmm. and talking to you in uh, uh, Mandarin. 
I didn't sleep last night on the stylus. Does anybody want to stab? Ah! Ah! Wow. Thank uh, you very much, ma'am. I appreciate your assistance. My wounds are still fresh. <laughs> okay. That? No problem. Uh, after that, uh, yeah, you, you get you get more patched up, and uh, she's like, "Oh, oh, these burns are horrible." And right, uh, you get you get fresh bandages and uh, kick back into play with the others. Ma'am, do you know where the old cov covenant was? Oh, you were lucky to you were lucky to get out that much, DJ. If you want to roll again on your ten percent, Tom them long time. Yes. Oh my gosh. Uh, Right. It appears that he's trying to talk to her, but he's not good at it. What do you two want to do? She keeps saying, what? Uh, he, he In Mandarin, I was like, he thanks you for cleaning his wounds. It's been a bit. She, she uh, says, oh, it is nothing. I have many sons in the army. Mm. Does anybody want stat rearrange? No, I do not, she says. Uh, what's that allow you to do? PC may deduct one point from one stat and add it to another stat. Max 20. Minimum 10 on any stat. Oh, play at the end of the adventure only. I didn't read the whole thing. Yep. Uh, hmm. She uh, asked Doc, uh, are you okay. enjoying your time in the Forbidden City? Did you I'll, want that or no? Yeah, I'll give you something for it. Let's see. Uh, yeah, here you go. You give me a try. Yeah. Shit. Oh, oh, oh. Hello. Hello. Hey, you speak perfect Mandarin. Ask about the covenant that was out here. All right, hold on. You were trading me cards instead of just throwing shit away. Ugh, I don't want it. I'm getting rid of my cards. Oh, right. Okay, so um, so what what's going on with the Forbidden City out here? It is a tourist area, as you see. Oh, just a tourist area? Nothing about it other than that? I do not understand. I, I look at Freddy in English. So what, what what are we doing here exactly? Well, apparently there's a convent in the Forbidden City where Mr. Zinn's sister is supposed to be. Oh, I ask her, is there a convent here? Oh, you are talking about the new Forbidden City. Oh, where's that? She says, you should oh, not go there. <laughs> it is uh, where the rich and famous go. The access is strictly limited to uh, people who have wealth and means. Mm. My friend's sister is there right now. You will not be given access. Well, if you could show, tell us where it is, at least, you know, we could go there and be refused. But we do wish to try. Uh, it is a very bad idea, but she reluctantly tells you where it is. Thank you. It has been walled off from the rest of the city. Mm. And as she describes it, you realize it's an arco arcology, mm. just like they had in San Angeles. Mm. As soon as you said walled off, I was like, here we go. <laughs> I'll be back. <clears throat> so we need to find the sewers, and I'm sure through the sewers, we can find our way in that bitch. Wait, what's an oncology? Oh, God. I have I just, Blah. Do you, do you know what oh. I'm talking about or no? No. San Angeles. Do you know yeah. how there was the arcology inside of San Angeles? No. Okay, so in San Angeles, there was an arcology where all the rich, richy people lived. And the way that we would go in there is we'd go and use the sewers. The sewers. Which we do know about. And so if we use the sewers, maybe that is here too. You can always give it a look. You guys uh, head over there and check it out. It looks as though uh, the only people who get in are super rich people. They have their own guard force, their own uniforms, their own security. It's a lot. It, it's giving you weird flashbacks to the uh, the thing. However, um, 
after prying up, after going somewhere uh, and prying up uh, some sewer covers, you know this sewer is completely different okay. and horrible, mm -hmm. horrible. Just imagine all the worst stuff in China. It's in there. So, uh, yeah, pretty much uh, everybody give me surveillance roles as you guys uh, are surveilling the place. Fortunately, you have army uniforms. Unfortunately, you don't really have jobs. Okay. Army is our job. Pardon? Oh, yeah, army is a job. Good point. Uh, surveillance? Oh, yeah, I got this. No problem. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. Uh, Fulton doesn't really pay attention to anything at all. He's more or less sleeping in the Jeep on and off. And he's like, no, mama, no, 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 no. yes, yes, no. Oh, you're a naughty girl. Freddie, and that mouse, I've been watching him for about two hours, the one out there in the field. <laughs> he's the key to all this. No problem. Now, uh, Freddie, you noticed that getting in, uh, it looks like unless you're in a car that costs like uh, 300,000 US, that that uh, your shit gets checked out um, real close. Uh, you saw a couple of rented limos pull up and try to get in. They got turned away. It's like rented limo. You obviously don't belong here. Fuck mm -hmm. off. 300,000? Okay. Oh, yeah, at least at least three hundred thousand dollars worth, and like all the all the bling to match type thing. You know, we're talking that kind of vehicles and shit. And yes, they do come here. Um, it oh, looks like lot. security. Uh, if if you're convincing, it's pretty light. They'll check out trunks and stuff. Anybody would like say a giant fucking battle axe can probably get it busted. But you know, if you have normal rich people stuff. I.e., not giant bloody battle axe. He doesn't clean it, you know. Then, um, then uh, you can get in. So, uh, you're thinking wrestling rad, driving around in uh, you know an amazing vehicle oh, or whoever with a Chinese disguise and flawless Cantonese or Mandarin rather. Oh, Mandarin. Oh, they have someone that speaks Mandarin. Oh yeah, Doc Fulton's really actually very very good at Mandarin. Uh, I belong all this to him. Um, I don't. How long do you think it'll take your people as a and this thing to uh refine all those gems and everything? What do you mean, your people? A bit, oh. <laughs> it'll take a okay. bit. Okay, um, now that is the front door, just so you know. Yeah, that's the front door, obviously. <clears throat> Got to be delivery trucks. There's got to be workmen. Card, of course. There's lots of delivery trucks in and out. We just follow those delivery trucks to where they go, and then fucking hitch a ride on them. Hitch a ride. Cut two. Uh, hold on. Are we gonna stand these uniforms? For now. Oh, no, I think you're going to be ditching that and becoming like laundry people soon. Mm. Okay. Cool. Okay. Yeah. Now, again, problem with weapons, battle axes, shit like that. If your vehicle gets searched and finds a big bloody battle axe, or white all people. I have is a, all I have is a pistol. Yes, a pistol probably mean the gig is up as well. Right, I just need some. Do you know any laundry people that fucking carry a pistol? Just need some time with uh, the well, no, we, Okay, no, just go back to the embassy, drop off your shit in the ambassador's quarters for the time. Yeah, absolutely not. So, what we can do mm -hmm. is uh, with some scrap metal, I can uh, just weld on a fucking little compartment that fucking nobody will be able to know that's not supposed to be there. We can put all kinds of fun shit in there. Okay. And is there room for a pistol and a lightsaber in there? Yeah, yeah if you need it to. Okay. Go for it then. If you right. think it won't get searched, I mean. Yeah. Okay. Go for it. Okay. Uh, Fred, Freddy, give me a grapple roll. 
and somebody else give me a club roll to grabbing and knocking out the guy. Everybody's wanting to be involved with this stealth rolls if you'd like a surprise round on him. If you just want to walk uh, up and go, hi! <laughs> you could. Don't suggest the battle axes. It may leave his uniform a bit bloody. Well, okay, so that's Freddy cool. says, we don't want a stealth roll. Let's just go into standard combat with this guy. And the guy goes, okay. Okay, I'll grab onto him anyway. Well, if you get to go first, let me check. Yeah. Heroes are first and set back. But everybody gets a card because you are in a city. Being in a city is a preferred action. Congratulations. But heroes are set back. He goes, whoa! <laughs> nice. <laughs> and... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> right. Of so Freddy, Freddy grapples. Yes. Yeah. And uh, who's got the club? <laughs> Give me a clubbing roll. He goes, whoa. <laughs> right. Fulton goes, and the guy puts up his foot, goes, <laughs> parries, and he goes, whoa. You have encountered the martial artist as your second. You that must, that must hurt though, like a blockhead club with your foot. Mm -hmm. Yes, but he is super good at martial arts apparently. But okay. you managed to get one guy by himself. So next round, oh sorry, he gets to go. He Just, goes. <laughs> wait, what about uh, Coburn? Oh sorry, Coburn. What were you doing? You just want to watch? Maybe masturbate a little. Um. I mean, I suppose I could fucking try to grab him. Sure, give me a grapple roll. Oh, he says. <laughs> Shit. All right. Um, all right. Uh, so, martial artist, huh? That's all right. I'll give him the old good old fashioned bear hug. We're going to make love, boy. Um, <laughs> I play the plus 20 grapple card. And, all right. And where the fuck is grappling? Oh, all the way up, all the way up, all the way up. Can't be having him punching people. Fail. However, with plus 20. Oh, with plus 20, he made it, yeah. Yay. No problem. He attempts to uh, headbutt Freddy in the submission. Oh, missed. Barely. And Freddy's like, oh, oh, we've got a live one. Next round. Heroes are first throwing hand grenades at this fucker is approved. I look around. <laughs> No problem, you guys, unless he starts making noise, but he, he's like, oh, there's only three of you. And so, uh, Freddy holds holds him. Do you want to just continue holding him? Well, I want to like, maneuver behind him. So it's okay. Clear. Sure, give As me a I'm maneuver. On. As I'm holding on, yeah. Doc, I'm trying to club him into submission again? Mm -hmm. Freddy gets behind him, and Doc flails away I with a uh, bad late. Fucking Doc hits you, Freddy. Well, that's exactly. a monster club, but yeah. 